Nothing justifies terrorism. No cause, no grievance. Nothing can ever excuse the indiscriminate targeting of civilians, the wanton destruction of lives and livelihoods, and the creation of panic for its own sake. Terrorism draws strength from resentment, humiliation, and lack of education. That is why human rights, all human rights, political and civil rights, but also economic, social and cultural rights, are unquestionably a part of the solution in fighting terrorism. And I'd like to suggest five key counter-terrorism priorities and underscore our respect for human rights and the rule of law will secure long-term benefits in the fight against it. Number one, we need much stronger international cooperation on counter-terrorism. The second key route to more effective counter-terrorism is a sustained focus on prevention. Number three, upholding human rights and the rule of law is the surest way to prevent a vicious circle of instability and resentment. Fourth, we must win the battle of ideas. We should never shrink from pointing out the cynicism and errors of terrorism. Fifth and finally, we must lift up the voices of the victims of terrorism. When we respect the human rights of victims and provide them with support and information, we reduce the lasting damage done by terrorists to individuals, communities and societies.